Hello everyone! Today we are going to show you a real true competition between two engraving machines. First is a big one, make block plotter XY 2.0 kit that we assembled in our endurance laser lab with 500 uh, milliwatt uh, blue laser. Another is a DIY engraving machine with our uh, brand new uh, El Chipo 3.5 watt laser. Now we are going to show you a real true competition between these two devices. Okay, Boris, let's start. We will start with a band box. Uh, this is a software that is used to operate uh, make block. So this software can use uh, vector image and raster image. So right now we uploaded uh, our logo, endurance logo, as a raster image and we actually started. You can see this guy is already working and doing the engraving. Okay, you can see it takes some time. But like I said, it's only 500 milliwatt laser. And you can see the electronic is working. Okay, buddies, let's start our um, DIY laser engraving machine. GRBL so, controller. Yeah, yes, we started from a GRBL controller. It's a new controller, it's a new system, it works pretty nice. But the case is that it works only using G code. So the difference between G code and raster image that we have here that the G code works faster and it's more efficient. Let me show you the difference. So you see that it goes uh, like dot after dot to make the full image. Here on a DIY machine it goes with not with dots but making special figures and you can see in the software how does it where it's now and like like we said it has also ZX so you can not only engrave using this machine but also cut if you put an actuator or stepper motor uh, to control your laser so you can see that 3.5 watt laser is really fast you can see that it's almost it's almost done and here is still in progress of our logo it takes more time definitely probably like five times more that is ready but is can you show us the result with a DIY so you can see the result it's done it's ready like I said to create it you need a G code it's very easy to convert an any raster or vector image into G code using an Inkscape plugin or you can use our own endurance laser plugin to control to convert into a G code but for some uh, people who would like to work with BMP files or uh, raster image bandbox uh, that uh, works with make block plotter may be more convenient so you make your own choice and yes let us show you the current result yeah it'll probably take another several minutes to make it done but uh, you see that competition won a DIY uh, engraving machine in terms of speed because it was more powerful laser. It is 3.5 watt laser, and here is like only 500 milliwatts, so it's seven times uh, less powerful. But uh, if you compare these two devices, this and that, you can see that uh, they are pretty much the same, the same looking, but the make block is bigger. It is uh, about 12 inch um, for uh, X 
and about 15 inch for um, uh, for Y coordinates so it's it's much bigger than DIY so hope you like this video please share with your friends subscribe on our channel and visit our websites endurancerobots.com and endurancelasers.com and hope that you will make a really magnificent engravings with endurance el cheapo lasers have a nice day